Meanwhile, and not in the MCU... boop a doop boop 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 ding dong Wait a minute. I don't remember ordering any pizza. <gasps> Wait a minute. It's... It's not my birthday, is it? Somebody told me to bring this hat box over here. Well, uh, I don't want to be rude. Uh, why don't you come on in? Let me grab some of your stuff. Make yourself at home. Hold on a second. You're not trying to catfish at me, are you? Because I already paid my dues to the Merchant Marines. Let me take that hat box off your chest. Wow, you really do have a beautiful home. I like how it just kind of opens up and it's like, wow, this is a lot bigger than what you'd see on the street and whatnot. Huh? Mm, my hands are cold. I see you got a lot of stuff that you just keep on putting on your shoulder for me to grab if from God you. If God made women with more arms, they wouldn't need men. Uh, you can leave the uh, gloves on an ottoman. I can uh, pick them up later and possibly use them. Oh yes, I definitely plan on losing uh, quite a few things while I'm here. But not the kind of things that you think I'd lose. After all, you know, I brought a lot of stuff. But not as much stuff as you. I beg your pardon, but I bought all this stuff myself. Well, maybe I do beg your pardon. <laughs> well, that's quite the comeback. Um, I'm going to sip on my tea. With such a big house, you might have... Oh, I beg your pardon? I can't understand you when I'm sipping tea. But I could be losing my hearing, knock on wood. Now that wood sounded exotic. <laughs> well, it is one of a kind. It's, uh, it's made of ducks. Hmm. Hence the uh, duck sound. Uh, I think I'm forget. Oh, that's right. I forgot to have breakfast. Well, if you have a kitchen hidden away in here, I can make you eggs. No, that sounds like a terrible idea. And that was the day I decided to open my own restaurant. Here, here's a couple customers that are just coming in right now. I'm going to go talk to them. Hi, dears. Well, come on in. We're going to get you a table. And you'll be well, quit nice. doing your job exactly like you're supposed to. How are you guys doing? You look like a fine young couple. Oh, yes, we're a fine young couple on the outside. <laughs> oh, yes, I remember being young and in a couple. But now, hmm, things change. As you can see here, there's been a lot of uh, caricatures on the walls. Uh, hey, uh, darling, why don't you just uh, take care of them? I'm, I'm just going to be over As here. As you can to... see, that was the owner. She's pretty great. Now I'm over here at the bar. Have I ever told you all my bar stories? Look at me. I'm in my pink. I'm talking over here. Now let's get back to that story. Do you know what I absolutely hate? I hate it when people just grab a book right on from a under me. A tale of three uh, villages. Again with this? It was the best western of times. It was the uh, decibels and hertz of times. Back in the day, it was like this and that, and I was just a boy, just minding his own business when, oh man, old Sally Sue was all like, hey, what's going on? I just want to have a good time. Hmm. <laughs> well, so, uh, what'll it be? Well, I could really use a good cappuccino. Oh. Huh. Couldn't we all? Oh, wow. That story over there is getting really boring. I better come in and, uh, freshen them things up. Don't mind my swagger. I'm gonna be right around here. Uh, hey, uh, could you get out of here? I'm just gonna be, uh, doing my thing here. I can help these guys. Alright, bye. <laughs> Sorry about that confusion over there. I'll be glad to help you. I'll even be at your table, ruining your date, being a third wheel. Everybody knows that a third wheel is a lot more stable than two wheels. I don't mind another person poking and prodding our relationship. Suppose this is the closest thing we'll get to a Black Widow movie, huh?